happy Friday, people. It is about, it's been threatening rain all week. We got a little bit yesterday. It is supposed to pour down today. So that does leave a threat of losing power. So I wanna try and knock today out pretty quickly. I don't even know what time it is right now. Hold on. 8.31, market just opened. Um, but I'm not gonna rush myself. Uh, the last few days have been there's been a lot of movement and that's really awesome but I've also been very busy I had to get new tires I have a lot of driving planned over the next couple of weeks so you know better safe than sorry um, but let's just take a look at what's going on on this lovely Friday all right let me pull up the daily chart Ooh, look at what happened here Pulled back in and gave a reversal bar. What I'm looking at are these MACDs right here. This bar is starting to pull back and there's really no indication of the pullback just yet. It doesn't mean that it can't change. Um, with it showing the strength to the outside like it is here, you can see that same thing happened here and then the next few bars it started going up but the BBs were still much lower. So it takes some time to catch up. Now are we looking for this to continue past our last you know, high that we have seen? I don't know. We'll have to watch and see. There's a lot of distance back to these EMAs which says that it's got a good possibility of traveling back. The MACDs have not made new highs, as we can see right here. Just look at how it's leading lower. Um, would it be difficult for it to push up? No. And actually, now that I'm looking at this a little bit closer, uh, or I'm sorry, in a little bit of the bigger picture, it doesn't look like strong BBs yet. I'm feeling really just unaligned this morning so I need to spend a few minutes making sure my purpose is clear my intentions are clear so I need to um, I need to go clear my head for a minute um, I'll be back pushing its way to that two point mark. Oh, and let me pull this puppy off.
go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and remove my trade I'm gonna exit here the way that this is a little lower here we tend to see somewhat of a pushback um, if it keeps going up more power to it Now, why am I not freaking out? It's just the way this is pulled away and it can really snap back. So I do still actually anticipate this to go up. Just got a little ahead of myself. And I'm expecting that here. I was one tick behind it, not two. I know my, I know my uh, rules, and I tend to. Uh, two would have had me right back here and still in it. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and call that a day, y'all. Uh, it's struggling for this BB to go up. Ideally, you'd want to see it just pop right up to the upside with how big that bar was up there. How much this is pulling away from the EMAs, what happens? We have a tendency to see a snapback. So I think I've reached my tolerance level personally. It's Friday. Uh, I got to pack up for the weekend. I won't be back until Monday. So I probably won't be trading on Monday. I'm going to leave during the day just to kind of beat the traffic on Monday in um, Austin. Um, next week, I will most definitely not be here on Friday. I'm leaving at 8 a.m. to drive to Louisiana and back so my daughter can go on a flight with a friend to go see a Korean pop band that she's in love with. So... Um, I hope that everybody has the most fabulous. This is an hour and 45 minute video. Oh, 
Uh, I don't know why I've been doing this lately. Hold on. Let's go back. Let's turn this on. Okay. Alrighty, guys. Uh, looks like it's going to try and keep going up, but I'm exhausted. I don't usually stick around this long. So, um, it's time for Mama to take a break. Got a lot of things to take care of today. So, I think I say that every day. So, I'm going to try and stop saying that so much because I'm trying to be very intentional on the words that I use so that my mindset throughout the day is completely intentional in my trades, in my relationships, in my actions, in my getting rid of road rage, you know, all that kind of stuff. So, <laughs> um, I hope that everybody has a wonderful weekend. And if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Uh, you can find me at Lindsay at responsible day trading.com support at responsible day trading.com info at responsible day trading.com. And then you can find me at responsible day trading on Facebook. You can find me Lindsay on Facebook, just wherever guys. If you need help, I'm here. So hope everybody has just the most glorious of weekends. Stay safe. And uh, I look forward to catching you on the profitable side.